Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing Halford's very own bike and bike repair stand. So if you guys go on to enjoy the video, please make sure to smash the like button and comment and also subscribe. Okay, so we've got the bike stand here. Box is a bit beaten up, um, but let's just get it all out, shall we, and uh, put it together. So, as you can see, this is my first video, guys. If you like anything to do with road bikes or bikes in general, uh, please make sure to subscribe. I'm going to be training for Ironman 2023, uh, so I'll, get, I'll be bringing you along with me uh, training. So if that sounds interesting, like I said, make sure to subscribe. Okay then, so it looks like we've got the main frame. It's quite long, as you can see. I made a mess everywhere. Typical. Here is the stand, what obviously goes on the floor. And here's the extension, as you can see it was quite big and I've made it smaller now. So if I just rest it on the floor, let's see what else is in the spot. So, we've also got a little tool, um, a little tool tray. And we've also got, obviously the bit where the bike actually goes onto and it clamps down just like this. So you've got it tight and just perfectly, just basically clamp that down, as you can see I've done there this just clamp this down so that that isn't moving nowhere okay so unfortunately i i haven't got a bike okay to demonstrate on because my bike hasn't arrived yet i just saw my mountain bike so obviously i haven't got one at the moment but if i if i can just show you briefly the you know rough idea of how how it works okay then guys so when i was watching videos on how to set this up i saw people struggling to mount this without it wobbling around everywhere now the thing that I saw people do the most was they done this and somehow they might basically they managed I'm not sure how but I heard do it then but rather than doing that okay so that is how it's meant to go as you can see that is meant to be like that yeah so rather than doing that if you can see this thread they put a thread through there and they were tightening this up the other way. Uh, that might not make sense to you, okay? But if you're doing this in person, you know, it might also. But this is a way you tighten this up, okay? I mean, for some of you, it might be pretty self-explanatory, but for others, it might not be. So I just thought I'd do a little show and tell, okay, on how you properly do actually set this up. So you just want to tighten this up. Just, just hand tight. Just a little bit more. I'd say that's about fine, okay? So you just want it to, you know, swivel. So wherever you're working, you can swivel it around. This is the finished product. So it's not too big, you know? It's not too big. So here are the legs. They've got nice four sturdy legs. I do like this design uh, for the floor, so it's nice and flat. Um, and obviously it will uh, rotate up and down. So if I just go by here and do this cog, you can see, this, this is how tall it can go. Wow, that's taller than me, okay? So you probably don't want it this high. Or maybe, actually. I mean, if you had it this high, the bike would probably be perfect, actually. But this is, you know, how high it can actually go from the floor. So I'm like five foot nine. So that must be six foot two at least. And then obviously, you know, once you get your bike in it, you just turn this, you know, left, left to loose pretty tighty, clamp it in, your bar goes in there, your frame, and jobs are good and basically. That's gonna be the end of the video. If you did enjoy if it did, you know, if you did if it did help you, please make sure to smack that like button and subscribe. As I mentioned, I will be getting another bike. Um well I'm recording this on Wednesday, so I'll be getting it on Tuesday. So in about seven days, I'll be getting my new bike and my GPS should be coming Friday. So look out for another video uh, on an unboxing and then set up on my GPS. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed, smack the like button and subscribe and I'll see you guys all in my next video.